Hello guys and welcome to this brand new channel called Android Development. The goal for this channel is to teach you guys the basics of Android app programming. And for the very basic of Android programming is to have a basic understanding of Java, which will be the first few videos will show uh, the basics of Java if you aren't, aren't familiar with it. Um, and then we'll get into Android and Android Studio afterward. So um, for starters you need to download a few things and uh, it's called uh, the JRE uh, which is uh, the Java runtime environment and the JDK which is the Java development kit. So uh, we're just gonna go ahead and download that now this this PC is completely fresh so uh, if you're just starting out it should be just as I do now so let's search for JRE uh, Java runtime environment and accept the license I run a 64 bit Windows 10 download this and we will uh, download the JDK which is just a quick Google search this JDK download this run the JRE uh, there we go install Java I'm just gonna install it to wherever the default location is and oh we need to download the development kit here, accept the license and 64-bit windows. And the third thing, while these are just downloading and installing and all that stuff, we're going to need, or we actually we don't need a um, editor, but so you can program Java in Notepad if, if you'd like. Uh, but I wouldn't recommend it as it's quite tedious so I'm gonna use a very plain uh, text editor which is called Atom um, the thing with Atom is that you get the uh, color codes and all that uh, but it's not quite Eclipse you can use Eclipse if you if you want to but I'm just going to learn you the very basics of uh, Java programming and uh, Atom will do just fine so uh, I'm going to come back to you when all of this is installed Alright, so everything has now installed successfully. And uh, if you go to this PC, local disk, program files, Java, and you should see JDK and JRE uh, with the respective versions. So, what we need to uh, find is the program called. Java. Here we go. So it's in the JDK folder in, and binary. So what we want to do is copy this file path. And you want to go to this PC, system properties, 
advanced system properties and we are going to set environment variables and uh, we're going to use system variables that'd be good and we got we're going to edit the path variable and here it has some other variables so we're going gonna just add a new one and paste your what wherever you install the JDK this would be the default location for the JDK so now you just click OK and you should be all set to start programming in Java so that will be the next video guys thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time